Glenn McInnes in net for the Pickering Panthers to face the Stouffville Spirit. And Pickering happy to welcome back Ben Pickle to the team, fresh off a silver medal for Canada East at the World Junior A Hockey Challenge. Evan Breckles with a face-off win, and moments later, it's going to be in the back of the net. David Paglia pulling the trigger on his fourth goal of the season. Owen Dunning looking to carry the puck in, but he's met hard by Charles Van Haberbeek. Spirit strike for a second time late in the opening period. Odero Wary, that's an even dozen for him, and it's a 2-0 lead into the second period. The Panthers grab a power play just eight seconds into the middle period, but they fall further behind as Iwero banks the puck off his teammate Peter Kusis. He will have 22 on the season before this game is over. None, I'm sure, involve less effort than the puck just bouncing off him for the 3-0 lead. Past the halfway point of the game before Pigray really threatens. Nice move from Jamie Darlison, but he's brushed aside by Kyle Downey. Panthers heavily outshot and outscored through two periods. Glenn McInnes, though, with a nice glove save in a game he uh, won't be remembering fondly over Christmas dinner. 6-0 after 40 minutes, so the Panthers introduced Gabe Donahue for his first taste of OJHL action. He didn't see a lot of shots, though, as uh, Stovall was content to just ride this game out with such a big lead. Also seen ice for the first time in Pickering, Emil Osfelder, who gets roped into a fight with Julian Demeglio, who will soon regret that. Obsfelder. Let's call him the Norwegian Knuckle. Just lays a sound thumping on Demeglio. But the Spirit, they do the thumping on the scoreboard, and that's what counts. To the tune of 6 0 with Kyle Downey earning the shutout win, the Panthers are going to close out the calendar year versus the Toronto Junior Canadians. Coming up next.